Hello, my children. I am the they call the puppet, and welcome back to Escaping the Prism. So, let's see how many cheese that we have. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. B A M F. B A M F. Ending. Escape the badass way. <laughs> Escape the sneaking way. Escape the legends way. Oh. All right, let's play it. Oh, you. Yeah. What? You're free to go. Really? I'm free to go. <laughs> You're joking. Package. Don't get your hopes up. What's gonna be in the package? Ooh. Oh, I can escape from. Let's do the um, teleporter. What, you already put my hands on? Mm. I'm gonna teleport it. Oh, I think I just got shot in. I think I got shot in right now. Okay, then. Let's use a cell phone. Oh, a cell phone. I love a cell phone. Call me on my cell phone. It's September 9th, 12:56 p.m. Okay. Show you what? Oh, oh, do I present? Oh, I have evidence. Is this this? This is a bag. All right, let's present. Is, is that the bag the defendant hid in? Yes, but there's one thing that's been bothering me. The defendant really was hiding in this bag, then. How did he tell the knot from the outside of the bag? If he was inside the bag, it'd be impossible for him to tie that knot on the outside. But then, how did he do it? It's simple. He didn't. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm saying my client wasn't hiding in that bag at all. He was stopped in there by this very witness. As you can see by this doctor's analysis, the defendant had taken quite a beating. While he was in the bag, he was okay. unconscious. This is absurd. The witness was attempting to dispose of the body. He left the defendant in the bag knowing he'd drive by it on the way back to the bank. When the witness and his partner passed the bag, he convinced his partner to throw the bag into the others. But why would he do that? Why? To dispose of the body, of course. For millions of bags of money in that bank, the witness knew it would take a long time before the victim was found. But unfortunately for the witness, his victim woke up and tried to escape from his tomb. He was arrested on the spot and the witness thought everything was over. Now, you guys can't, you can't, you can't, really? you can't be happening to me. Really? Well, that certainly was an interesting trial. However, I'm now ready to deliver my verdict. I find the defendant, Henry Stickman, not guilty. I'm not guilty anymore. I'm free. Wow. Yes. What? No, I'm not. Another thing? Okay, uh, for reasons of this video, I think you like it. Uh, please subscribe to the channel, I really hope this out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everyone!